Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw ruby bridges. I'm going to take three fingers from the top right here in the center and put a dot. And from that dot I'm going to draw an oval. I come to the bottom on the left hand side and I draw one straight line down on the left, one straight line down on the right, come back to the left, connect with a slightly curved line. I come over on the left and I draw a curved line down all the way off the page on the left, come up, draw a curved line down all the way on the right. I come back to the left and I draw a straight line down on the left, come back to the right and draw a straight line down on the right. In the center I'm going to draw one curved line to the left, come back to the center, one curved line to the right. Come back to the left and draw little curved lines all the way come back all the way to the right. I come over here on the left and I'm going to draw a curve line out, curve line in, connect on the left, jump over and I'm going to draw a curve line out, curve line in, connect on the right. I come inside and I'm going to draw a curve line, curve line, connect on the left, and a curve line, curve line, connect on the right. I'm going to come back to the left and draw a slightly curved line in on the left and draw another curved line in on the right. Now I don't want to make, I want to make sure that I color this in the correct way so she looks like she's looking. So I'm going to fill these sections in with black right now so I don't forget. I come right in the center and I draw a little curve line over and then a big curve line, little curve line, little curve line. And I'm going to go one, two, three straight lines, one, two, three straight lines. Now I come right over here on top and I'm going to draw one baby circle. Then I'm going to draw on the right hand side, straight line out, curve line down, straight line in, connect on the right. Now I'm going to do the same thing on the left, straight line out, curve line down, straight line in on the left. Now I'm going to start right here on the left and draw a wavy, 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 wavy line inside and now a wavy, wavy line outside. I come on the right hand side and the same thing wavy, wavy, wavy line on the inside, wavy, wavy line on top. Come down to the bottom and draw a wavy, wavy line connect on the left and a wavy, wavy line connect on the right. I'm going to come back up to my bow and I'm going to do wavy, wavy, wavy line out, wavy, wavy line in connect. That's her braid. Okay, we're ready to color. Okay, I'm going to color her bow red and I'm going to color her jumper blue. I'm going to leave everything else white. So she's red, white, and blue. Then I come up with my black and I color in her braid on top and I color these little sections of her hair with black down below. And don't forget the part by her neck. And then I take my brown crayon and I color in her neck. Don't forget her ears and her face. Okay, let's see what Ruby looks like all colored in. Here's Ruby all colored in ready for her first day of school. 
and she's a true American hero and she just proves to you that little kids can make a difference. Okay, bye-bye.